here. They're nearly three wide coming through the turn. Uh oh, oh, contact, contact, three cars in the wall. 60, 43, 38. Oh man, the double zero, the three involved. Oh man, the 21 car. Whoa, huge split for the double zero, Ryan Gregory. Oh, Cannon five. Big hits to Jeff Gordon, Giancarlo Arenda. And the double zero went flying. Taking a look at what happened right here. As you can see, it looks like the 60 just slides up the track just a little bit. Gets hooked on the 38, and after that, it's game on, and everyone's in the wall. Chase Coyote had a real... Almost got into it. Lucky to avoid it. And right there, the 60 slides back down in front of the 3. Not really much Jeff Gordon could have done. He can't really see. A little bit of a camera issue right there, but you can tell that the 60 slid back up in front of the double zero. Just an unfortunate set of circumstances right there. Here's uh, the 21, Denny Nolasco Luna. This is what he saw. Oh, he just crushes his double zero. That might, that must have been what sent him flipping. That impact right there, that was hard. And now we look through Ferenda's uh, 48 car. Oh, yeah, that's the hit that sent him flying. And Ferenda got in the wreck when he got kind of committed to a line and Jeff Gordon came up in front of him. And here we see what happens. He, he comes up a little bit and you see right there, a the little jerk. That's where he gets clipped by the 38. And after that, he gets, he's going around and he, he, the three of them are in the wall. It's a big, big wreck. And now let's check out that flip from Ryan Gregory. Because that was scary. Oh, so yeah, that I was right. He, the 60 came up in front of him. He had really nowhere to go. Oh, and the violent hit by the 21. He just sent violently over. And here's a look at it in real time. Looking at the double zero. Oh yeah, he just is sent violently over. Blows over, lands on his roof. 